This is how to get follower and gift alerts on TikTok Live so that you can display them on your PC live stream. I'll walk you through this from start to finish, including downloading the code, setting it up, and also setting up OBS. As ever, if you need any help, feel free to join my Discord. It's linked in the description. Okay, so we'll be using this project from Isaac Kogan to set up the alerts. So I've linked this in the description so you can follow along. So step one here is install Node.js and I've already done that on my system, but it's pretty simply just click on the link, install it on the website. It's just like installing any other program. Once you've installed Node.js, come back to this website. It says extract the zip file, but this is actually showing the wrong link right now. So I'm gonna click on code at the top and then download the zip file here instead. Once you've downloaded it, just extract it wherever you want. I'm just gonna stick it in my downloads. And as you can see, it's now been extracted. Now we are technically missing a step here. You need to download something to open the code with. So I recommend downloading Visual Studio Code. It's linked in the description if you wanna download it. Once you've got Visual Studio Code downloaded, I'm just gonna click onto the Explorer in the top left corner, click on Open Folder, and I'm gonna find my project here. So I'll put it in my downloads. Here it is. I'm gonna click into it and open the base folder. Of course, it's asking me to trust it. So of course, yes, I trust the author. Now that I've opened it in VSC, I'm just going to click on Terminal at the top, click on New Terminal, and at the bottom here, I'm going to type npm space i. That's going to run some code. So once npm i has done its thing, we're actually almost ready to go. Of course, we need to input the username of the person whose alerts we want, which is probably your username, but I'm just going to use an example of somebody else right now. So I'm simply going to click on Public, and then click on config.json, and I'm gonna replace this with somebody who I know is live right now. So that's Atomic Grow. So now we've entered the username that we want. One final step, we go in the terminal at the bottom. We type node server.js, hit enter. And as you can see in the bottom, it says the server is now running. So we're just gonna copy and paste this link. We'll need this for our OBS. And we can go check it out right now. So here it is. As we can see, this is a very popular live stream, which I've set it to. So there's a lot of new follows and a lot of new gifts coming through. And now all we have to do is put this into OBS as a browser source. Okay, so here's my OBS. And all I'm gonna do is click on the plus button at the bottom, click on browser, and we're gonna call this TikTok alerts. I'll press okay. And it's now asking me for a URL, which is the localhost URL. Do not click local file, even though this is technically a local file. I'm just going to set the width and the height to the regular width and height of a monitor at 1920 by 1080. Click OK. And any second now, there should be our first alert popping up. There we go. Complete with the sounds. And as per usual, we can move these around. We can do whatever we want with them. Put them anywhere. We can shrink them. And do as we like. So there we go. Pretty much as simple as that. And I'll just show some basic things you can change in the config.json here. You can change the volume. So if you want no sound or anything, this volume slider is between zero and one. Just set the volume to zero. You can also set specific sounds for different gifts. So the rose is set to this enchanted file. And you can upload anything into your sounds directory to change the sound for each gift. These durations here for fade in, fade out, fade after, these are all in milliseconds. And these are color codes here. Feel free to play around, but of course the most important one is the unique ID, which is the username. So thanks for watching guys. If you need any further help, feel free to join my Discord linked in the description or Isaac's Discord, which I've also linked in the description and enjoy the alerts.